Next Gen 720, and I'm back with another video. Wow, wow, wow. Now, this, I actually, believe it or not, man, shout out to my man Hardy. I wasn't even going to do a video today. I just came back from the movies. I just seen Star Trek. Two thumbs up. Now, with that being said, um, Nintendo had a Nintendo Direct today. And I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to point out one of the main reasons Nintendo was in the shape that they are right now because Nintendo was in denial and a lot of you fucking Nintendo fans are in denial. Now I want you to listen to this, okay? Now, I want, and this is not the, the sole purpose of the video because Microsoft, these motherfuckers out, they, Microsoft, these motherfuckers is crazy, man. But check it out. Listen to this here. Listen, listen to my man Shokyo. Let's do him. It's been a tone to break. Here is my video recapping it all and uh, giving my thoughts on it. Now, like I said in my video yesterday, if you had high expectations for that particular direct, then, yo, you're stupid. Okay. What? Now, now listen. This is, listen, when I say this is the king of all damage control, what would, if you're saying not to expect much from this Nintendo Direct, from Nintendo, why the fuck didn't do it Direct? Now, you do know Microsoft is unleashing this motherfucking beast next Tuesday. Why not try to steal some of this thunder from Microsoft? Here's, here's the White Knight saying, if you don't expect much from Nintendo out of this Nintendo Direct, you're stupid. So what was the purpose of you having a direct? If you're sitting on your own mouth, you know the shit was going to be subpar, or, you know, it's not going to be nothing great, nothing excited about it. What I mean, well, this is what I mean when I say Nintendo fans settle for any goddamn thing. And this man's coming out of his own mouth, a Nintendo fan is saying that you're, you're a fool to expect much from Nintendo, you know what I mean, at this Nintendo Direct. So what's the purpose of having a fucking video conference from? Isn't it supposed to get you your fans and everybody riled up in the industry see what you, what your console has to show, has to offer? No. Luigi U. Like, come on, man. Another Sonic goddamn game. That's what I mean. Nintendo fan, settle for anything. But this is not, this is not the, this is not why I'm making this video. I want you to listen to my people's over at Microsoft. Check them out. Now, this is IGN. Check them out, though. This is what Microsoft did. I'm here with IGN News. A senior software engineer and architect at EA Sports has shared his thoughts on Nintendo's struggling Wii U console. When surprising news broke yesterday that EA has no Wii U games in development, someone from Microsoft reached out to EA Sports employee Bob Summerwill, asking him if it was because EA was having problems or because the Wii U is dead on arrival. Now, someone from Microsoft reached out to EA when it's come out and said that EA is not making any games for the Wii U, don't have anything in development. Somebody from Microsoft reached out and said, why, because the Wii U was having problems or because the Wii U was dead upon arrival? Check him out. Let's listen to his response. What follows are Summer World's multiple responses. The Wii U is crap. Less powerful than an Xbox 360, poor online store, weird tablet. Nintendo are walking dead at this point. The Wii U is less powerful than the Xbox 360. This is coming from EA! Nintendo are still operating like it's 1990. True! They should have done a Sega and offered Mario and Zelda as PS4 and Durango exclusives. Exactly! These motherfuckers still operating like it's 1990. Okay? Nintendo is the, how you can say, it was the god-grandfather of goddamn gaming. You know what I mean? But why do they lash through the door with every goddamn thing? Bringing these motherfuckers into the new millennium is like pulling teeth. Like I said before, they're seven years late to the HD party. Mike, when, when EA came out of their mouth, I'm sorry, when said they're not, making, they're not making any games for the motherfucking Wii U. Microsoft reached out and said, why? Because Nintendo's having problems right now or because it was dead upon the environment? This is crazy. Listen to them. Let's listen to the shit again. Listen to these motherfuckers. Like, this is like, now these, like you know what I mean? Like I said, listen, this is some real shit. They're saying what we already knew already. Software engineer and architect at EA Sports has shared his thoughts on Nintendo's struggling Wii U consoles. When surprising news broke yesterday that EA has no Wii U games in development, someone from Microsoft reached out to EA Sports employee Bob Summerwill Asking him if it was because EA was having problems or because the Wii U is dead on arrival. What follows are Summer World's multiple responses. The Wii U is crap. Less powerful than an Xbox 360, poor online store, weird tablet. Nintendo are walking dead at this point. Nintendo are still operating like it's 1990. They should have done a Sega and offered Mario and Zelda as PS4 and Durango exclusives. Instead, they make this awful console, just stop it, just make great games. It is an utterly intentional decision to focus our resources on markets which actually matter, like mobile and Gen 4. Summer will conclude by saying, Nintendo platforms have always been very poor revenue-wise for third parties. Only Mario and Zelda make money. 
Okay, now with that being said. This article, right, even though, like I said, Microsoft was, you know, fucking with them, you know what I mean? Taking shots at these motherfuckers, you know, it, it's the truth, though. Late, ladies, and the reason why, like I said, Nintendo continues to act this way or operate this way, I'm sorry, because you got fans like fucking Shokyo, and the Nintendo, they settle for fucking anything. This man made a video and said, you are fucking stupid if you thought, if you were expecting a lot from Nintendo's Direct that's coming out today. Why the fuck not? Like I said, Microsoft announced their next console next Tuesday. Why not steal some of that glory? Like, come on. They show Pikmin 3. A bunch of fucking colorful ants. Like, come on with this shit. This all you guys got? Pikmin 3? The wonderful world of 101? The fucking, again, that's two hours long? Like, come on, man. Like, I, I really don't understand... You know what I mean? I don't understand, you know, why Nintendo continues to make these mistakes. They answered everything is, you know what? We're going to get a deal with uh, Sega. We're going to make... Who the fuck gives a fuck about Sonic? I'm just being real. If Sonic was that hot of an item, you know what I mean? The Dreamcast would have went out of goddamn business, okay? Sonic is not the answer to these Wii U woes. He says he's going to bring the casual game. Who the fuck really gives a fuck about Sonic? I'm just being real. Y'all gotta buy me that Wii. Y'all gotta get that, that, that new and exclusive Sonic game. Like, are you are you serious, Shokyo? He goes on to say that by Nintendo getting Sonic, uh, man, this is a big deal for the Nintendo because you know a lot of casual players, you know, uh, they like Sonic. A lot of casual players want to spend four hundred dollars to play Sonic. You know what I mean, that's what you tell me. So you know, my grandma's gonna get out the bed right now. You know what? Hey, 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 hey Zaya, can you please buy me a Wii U because I want to play Sonic in my church. I bought my grandmother a Wii for the church and shit, you know what I mean? I got it a Wii. I bought one for home when I bought one for the parishioners, you know what I mean? When they play, they, when, they, when the old folks play their bingo and shit, you know what I mean? I did that. I don't hear my grandmother saying, hey, sonny boy, can you please get me that Sonic U? Like, come on, man. That ca that gimmicky casual shit is not the answer to the Wii U woes. Nintendo needs some fucking killer IPs, not the shit that just, you know, are good for Nintendo fans. This is the shit that's going to appeal to everybody. That's going to appeal to me. That's going to appeal to heartache. That's going to appeal to Bond. Dream 308. Something like that's going to bring us in. And Sonic is not going to do it. Luigi U is not going to do it. Like I said before, Nintendo Directs are for Nintendo fans. That was the most boring shit I ever seen in my fucking life today, man. Being fucking honest. That shit was like watching fucking paint dry. Fuck, I need oxycontin, man. Yo, uh, 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 listen, man. Uh, you know, I, 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 I can't put up with this shit, man. I'm sorry, man. Like, that, like, that. I love a great cup of coffee. Yo, I'm just, I'm just being real, man. Like, fucking Sonic and Mario, you was not gonna do it. Getting games like Grand Theft Auto. You know what I mean? That would do it. You know what I mean? Like, you... Oh, like the guy, like they said, like EA said, making money on the Wii third has always been a problem for third parties. Now, I mean, only Zelda and Mario make money. And I said this before, I remember when I first, when I first came to YouTube, I was only for like two or three weeks, I debated Shokyo. And I said to him, I said, only really Nintendo first party titles sell. The rest of the shit really doesn't sell. You know, it's a bunch of fucking shovelware. You know what I mean? Now, he, like he, now it's me trolling, but you know you got motherfuckers from all, that's inside the industry saying this industry, sorry, industry saying the same goddamn thing. That's just being real. Only Nintendo first party titles sell. I'm just being real. You know, like you know, I'm just being honest. You know, like, like wow. And I'm gonna be honest with you. Then they release a console that's really basically on par with the Xbox 360. Like, like, you know, and, man, like I said, I'm done, man. Like I said, you, look at yourself, man. You diehard Nintendo fans, you guys are what's wrong with Nintendo, man. Because, like I said, you let Nintendo pee in the cup and say, Mmm, I want her. Is that apple juice? No, my son. That is pee pee. Japanese pee. Or you let motherfucker Reggie take a shit in the ice cream cone and you say, Ooh, Reggie, chocolate ice cream. No, motherfucker, that's shit. No, it's not, Reggie. I'm just being real, like you motherfuckers are the, like, 
I, like I said, I can't do I, I don't know what the fuck is wrong with y'all when y'all will settle for anything. Like, you motherfuckers are crazy. Weird. Uh, I, you know, I'm going to tell you how crazy you motherfuckers is. I'm going to check this shit up. I'm about to wrap this video up. But anyway, I left an article, a little piece of an article in the chat I was in earlier. You know what I mean? With sax. And, you know, and, and, and I want to read to what this this developer and this uh, journalist had to say, right? Now, check this shit out. It says, Nintendo can't compete with Microsoft and Sony. That's why they pulled out of E3 pissing contest. That's almost a di um, dignified admission of defeat. If Nintendo showed off new Star Fox, Zelda, Mario, and Blast Corp titles next month in LA, it's only going to be preaching to the converted Wii U crowd. You know what I mean? They will be drowned out by the bombast and great swinging balls of their rivals. That will, <laughs> that will the LA Times, the Rooters, the BBC, T Tech, uh, Joystick Venture Beat Game, and yada, 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 You know what I mean? Basically, saying like, what everyone's saying, like, like motherfucking Nintendo's bowing out. You know what I mean? They know that they can't compete with Microsoft and Sony when it comes to tech. And, you know, was, what they're bringing new to the goddamn the system. You know what I mean? But what they're going to do, they're going to show a Star Fox and a Zelda game. And then like I said, that is only appeal to fucking Nintendo fans. That's being real. Let me, uh, in news, like I said, I'm going uh, I'm to I'm give you guys a, 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 some free advice. I understand that we sold 95 million consoles, but those was not 95 million gamers, hardcore gamers. You know what I mean? Or gamers. That shit was bought up by the casuals. You know what I mean? People that really don't give a fuck about gaming. That maybe played one or two games. My grandmother has a Wii. She may have played it twice in nine months. Is she a gamer? No. You know what I mean? And by, like I said, them showing Zelda and Mario, that only appeals to people that like Nintendo first party titles. Like, come on. Uh, when I said this, and I, and I left that account, these motherfuckers said, oh, you, man, you know, fuck it, man. Shout out to them guys. Shout out to all the Wii U owners that like the George Dicks in their spare times. You know what I mean? You know what's crazy? That's how much of a damage control article, artist show you is. Ultra inflated my inbox with a bunch of homosexual pictures. And they hit Shokyo and my video. Nah, it was only two pictures that I seen. And, like, come on, this is not the first time. This, these motherfuckers took my face and put it on another man's body while two men were having sex. And they put this shit on Facebook. Like, this is this is crazy. But he, he no, that's not, you know, it's like, I'm just, man, these motherfuckers with their damage control, with their lies. Like, I swear, man, if I should see those motherfuckers in person, whether it be Trey or Sh I think I would really break one of these motherfuckers' jaws, man. His joke, he Dr. Trey makes a video it's about, oh, the Wii U launch game, they were only running on two cores. Oh, my God. Well, if the games could be on par with the 360 or two cores, Magic can do with three cores. Are you serious, Trey? Are you fucking serious? So there is another whole generation that you guys are going to have the least powerful goddamn console. That's not going to get any next great next generation games again. You know what I mean? That's real talk. We want to wrap this video up, man. And as I always say, bang, bang. <laughs> Damn, dope. Microsoft said, what? Because that shit was dead on arrival? <laughs>